hello everyone this is deepthi thank you so much for stopping by in today's video i am going to show you how to make the slimline card using kriyalize latest release and i am going to use this film strip slimline dies and then the smaller version of chinese puzzle dies and words dies with shadows you can find all the list of supplies in the description below for the card base i took a four size white card stock and cut into two half vertical and joined them together by folding one edge over the other piece then i partially die cut it out using outer most slim line dies don't worry about the folded edge over the card front i'm going to cover it up with another card panel now to make c background i took realize watercolor paper and i'm going to use realize pigment colors i have used shades of green and blue with the number 13 18 and 20 I sprinkle these pigment colors on watercolor paper and spray water using Kriyalize spray pen. As soon as I sprayed the water, it started reacting with water. You can leave it like this um, and heat dry it. But I wanted to mix the colors completely, so I added more water and started moving the paper to mix the colors. I heat dried it in between and added more colors to add some texture. Here I ink smooth the card panel using the same pigment colors which I've used earlier to further add some texture. Now I'm quite satisfied with the background. I stencil this using Kriyalize circle stencil first with white ink and then with the statue color distress oxide just to add some layers. I die cut out this panel and adhere it to the card base along with die cut out film strip. Now my card base is ready and to add the fishes I have used this Chinese puzzle dies where I took two white card stock squares and ink blended it once I was done I sprinkled some water to add some interest and I cut it out using Chinese puzzle dies And now to make the fish, I googled with 10 gram fish shapes, and I got so many options. And out of that, I like this one. So you can choose whatever you like. And then I built the shape and um, put it together using non-permanent tape, and added foam tape behind it to give some dimension, which I later added to the card base.
I decided to add the sentiment before freshers for that I have used happy birthday dies which is a part of new release and it has a shadow also I cut it twice and layered it so that uh, I can give some thickness then I added this layered sentiment on the die cut out shadow part which I ink blended and then I glued this sentiment on the card base using foam tape Add the fishes and for the final touch up I added some matching sequins and googly eyes and if you notice that this googly eyes on the fish has some eyebrows printed on it and my little one told me mama this fish is looking so mean with this eyebrows so here I replaced it with normal googly eyes I enjoyed making this card and getting the feedback from my little one I hope you like it too Thank you so much and if you like this video give a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Bye bye.